What's up, guys? Do you want to teach me? You want to teach yourself how to climb up the walls? I'm going to show y'all how to do it. Jason McCall has no problem scaling the walls of his house. So, Mama's sleeping. <laughs> and I took her phone and I put it on something to record. And then I climbed the wall. Reading, though, came with some challenges for the Glen Burnie second grader. So his mother, Heather, got creative. To actually see himself in a book, um, I thought that would encourage him to have a little fun with reading. Over the summer, Jace and his mom started writing the adventures of Jace the Great, climbing the walls. Heather knew she wanted her son to be the protagonist. And when it came to finding the story for the book, they didn't have to look too far. As I looked at the video, we laughed with family and friends. At that point, I said, you know what? Let's make it into a book. This week, Jace got to share that story with his classmates at Sally Elementary School. Jace was a silly boy, and he had a clever trick. He would climb all the way up the walls. Jace the Great! Not only has writing the book helped to improve his reading skills, it's making an impact inside the classroom as well. As Jace was reading with some of them, we asked, who else wants to be an author? And all their hands went up, and they just were inspired just by watching that Jace could do it. They believed that they could do it too. Heather McCall hopes this will not only serve as an inspiration to other children, but also empower parents to find creative ways to help to get their children interested in reading. At Sally Elementary School in Anne Arundel County, Tim Tootin, WBAL, TV 11 News. But wait, there's more. Jason is mom already working on book number two. It is called Big and Small, The Adventures of Jace the Great Climbing the Walls. It is available right now on Amazon. This is your official invite to 11 TV Hill. Jace, I'll be waiting for the phone. Have your people call my people.